Hello everybody and welcome back to Foreclosed. My name is of course Constantine and we were left off in the previous episode. We actually managed to discover the ability of kinetics or something like that. Uh, we are going to be able to control things, objects, move objects from a distance and that's going to be really awesome. So uh, without further ado, let's just grab our gun back as you guys can see right here. Let me see if I can actually put some more upgrades into it. Um, actually, oh yeah, we have to put all the upgrades back in apparently because they have been removed for some reason. So that should all be good now, I think. And uh, let's just get out of here. Oh God. Look at this, they're running away. They did not manage to spot me, unfortunately. I was really hoping I could be able to take him. Oh God, hold up, hold up. I don't know if that guy I saw me or not, but my ride. There had yeah. to be another way out. All right, so we gotta go this way apparently. Uh, but the thing is, gotta make sure I <laughs> stay away from these fellas. Man, the headshots are just so epic. These guys have um, armor though, so it's not really that easy to take him out. Let me just grab this thing, take it with me, I guess. Oh my god. It didn't take him out though. Come on, buddy. Get out of here. So it's really interesting that we're probably not going to have multiple guns that we're going to be able to have in this game. Uh, all we're going to have is just this gun that we're going to be able to actually give him different upgrades, allowing it to act differently, like a shotgun or stuff like that, I guess, or a machine gun, I guess I could say. All right, uh, let's go to level zero. Minus one. All right, so we are we were at level zero. Zero, never mind. Blank. Wait, is it? I think it's stuck. Yeah. <laughs> Man, I just love the look of this game, though. Just because it has this comic book style to it, it's so cool. In there, there was no help Dahlia could give. But at that point, I was wondering if our controversial collaboration would take me anywhere. Yeah, I don't even know, buddy. Well, I was trying to figure out if I need uh, this barrel or s on something. Uh, let's just see what we can do here. So up to this side, we don't really have anything. Uh, if I'm going to make my way up to here... This is also not offering anything to me. So I keep on wondering if I even need this barrel. That it seems it disappeared. Never mind. Alright, let's keep on going down. I guess uh, this is where I gotta go next. Uh, this is gonna be down, right, up, up. Hmm. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be working because it's all glitched out. So I may need to take a different path out. Uh, can I maybe use these barrels to blow it up? Nope, we can just only move them away so that I can use that, I guess, yeah. <laughs> and we can definitely not go at the bottom there. Alright, let's keep on going then. Uh, crouch, buddy. There we go. Look at that, we got Crossing more Crossing the threshold awesome. of Keyclose's office. I thought I could see the light at the end of the tunnel. But that light turned out to be a speeding train. <laughs> ready to bulldoze what was left of my hopes. All my efforts went into fighting to get rid of who was hindering me from reaching the court, only to find that the law itself was enemy number one. Yeah, that's exactly it. Now, it does look like this woman is trying to keep on contacting me, but she's unable to. And there's also a passage through here. But this one is kind of blocked, yeah, so I think I gotta go through uh, this side. I wonder if I need to uh, remember these numbers, 96. I don't even know. Alright, let's see what this is all about. So we got up, right, down, left. There we go. Hacking into systems. Interesting. I mean, it doesn't look like we gotta use WASD here to move things around. Oh, just like that. There we go. Ah, you know what I gotta do? I think I know. I think I know. I think I gotta put it this way. Move it this way and lower it down now. There we go. And this should probably work. Let's see. 
Yeah, we definitely can go in climbing now. Awesome. All right, that's just more barrels. Anything on the sides? Ooh, hold up, we got something here. Not sure exactly where it is. Oh, right there. And thankfully, this is giving me more XP. I'm pretty sure very soon we're gonna be able to upgrade our gun again. Come on, buddy, just move it away. There we go. Let me just see, can I actually upgrade it now? Hmm. Oh, I think we need two, yeah, two upgradables in order to do it. As for the guns, we don't have enough. Alright, never mind. In that case, let's just keep on going. She keeps on trying to contact me. Sorry, mate, but uh, apparently cannot. I think I gotta shoot through that, yeah. Can I go through there? Nope, never mind. Up, left, down, left. Awesome, that worked. Is it gonna bring in enemies? I don't even know. Oh, we had to open that up, and now we gotta close this down. Or just close both of them down, never mind. And this way we can now go on top of it, I guess, and cross the other side, yeah. Alright, no collectibles here. All I gotta do is just make my way through here and cross through the sides. Perfect. Oh, anything on the sides? Nope. Empty, dilapidated, and oddly quiet. That place was an absurd metaphor of my mood. For the first time that day, it was quiet enough for me to hear my own thoughts. And nothing good could come from it. That silence was not just quiet. It was pure desolation. The door that we just saw there was the door that I was actually trying to open up, but of course I couldn't. What do we got here? Wait, there was something over to that side. I should have checked out. Hold up, let me go back down. And while this is happening, let's also check and see if we can get more upgrades. There we go. Alright, this one is use telekinesis to automatically propel bullets towards your target. What? I would love to actually put this one in. Explode on impact, penetrate your ammo and helmets, the bullets can penetrate energy shields. You know what, let's just put this one. How do I remove all of them? Let's just uh, put this one in, this one, and this one. Hold up, again. Here we go. Yeah, let's just try it out like that. Let's see how this goes. And before we go anywhere else, let me just check because, yeah, look at that, I knew it. I knew that there's gonna be some more XP here that I was uh, just about to lose. There we go, we got it. I play these type of adventure games uh, so much in the past that I kind of know exactly uh, all the spots where uh, developers are gonna hide things away from us. Oh wait, I got that going, but uh, apparently I gotta find another control somewhere right here. Nothing on this side. Seriously? Oh, hold up, I think I just spotted it right here somewhere. There we go, we got it. So that's one. We gotta find more? Or was that it? I don't even know. Yeah, I think that was it, actually. Never mind. Was it? Hmm. It does feel like I'm gonna need more, though, in order to open this up. Yeah, look at that. It's not gonna work. Interesting. Oh yeah, there's more, never mind. Alright, let's look for more then. Uh, apparently... I don't know what this is doing here, but I cannot really make use of it. No, nope, go back, go back. The control has to be around here somewhere. Hmm. I think I know what I gotta go, actually. Hold up, I think I know, I think I know. I think I gotta go at the bottom using the elevator. And then make my way at that broken doorway. Pretty sure about it. Yeah, look at that. It showed me that I'm getting close. Which means... This should be... Right here somewhere. Yeah, look at that. We got it. Awesome. So that's another one. Uh, let's see. Nothing on this side. But we do have one over here. Alright, and ultimately we gotta find the third one. 
which is probably all the way on this side somewhere. Is it here? Yep, it's right here somewhere. Man, I'm really enjoying the puzzle side of this game. It's really good. Alright, we got it. Look at that. Awesome. It is, of course, going to have us going back and forth, trying to unlock doorways and stuff like that, but uh, I really enjoy that uh, part of uh, experience in these type of games. Alright, and now we should be able to cross through this gateway. There we go. Awesome. Hold on, buddy. We gotta watch out. Apparently, we're being watched. Huh. Finally. What the hell happened? I've been trying to contact you for hours. Was the implant damaged? Uh, sorry, Kari. I have no time for chit-chat now. I need to get out of here. I'm fine, and I know who's behind all this. Yeah, let's go with that. I'll explain later. Okay. Well, I'll need a few minutes to locate you anyway. Here's a cryptic contact link. Call me back as soon as you can. I have to know what happened. Hmm. So she just gave me a contact link. I'm guessing now I'm going to be able to probably call her myself. I don't even know. Um, oh, what am I supposed... Oh, I think I got to fix this somehow. Yeah, but I, I got to connect it to here. How do I even do that, though? Interesting. Uh, maybe I gotta connect this thing to here. And this thing to here. Ooh, we got it. There we go. Fix it. That was awesome. And unfortunately, I gotta go inside. I really wanted to explore a little bit more outside of this place, but I guess it's too late now. I told her everything. As long as the implants were dependent on my survival, I could keep pretending I had a friend. Building 3. There's an elevator there you can use to leave the complex. I have an idea for a plan B. But first of all, I need you to get out of there. Alright, so she's telling me that I gotta go to Building 3. Hold up, let me grab this secret over here. Just so I can get myself more XP. There we go. Perfect. That's what I wanted. Uh, so I gotta get on that building, apparently. I'm not quite sure exactly how I'm gonna be able to do it. Hmm. Oh, God. Hold up. Hold up. Apparently, I'm gonna have to be a little bit stealthy here. Come on, take him out, take him out. There we go. There's one. I gotta stay away from this fellow. Apparently, this one has an armor. What the heck? <laughs> well, this is just always take him out, though. Oh. Stealthy like that. That was awesome. All right, that was another one. Uh, let me try to make my way to this fellow as well over here to try to take him out stealthily as well. There is another one over to that side. Let me just take you out, buddy. Look at that. Easy. Uh, I don't see anybody on that side. I mean, there are quite a few people. Yeah, so I gotta pay attention. There we go. That one is done. I wonder if these fellows are actually going to be able to see themselves. I don't even know. <laughs> oh, I think I knocked that guy's shield off. That was awesome. What the heck? This guy's not dying. No, what's happening? Run. <laughs> I don't even know what happened there, but uh, that guy was not dying. Wow, look at that. That was awesome. Again, using these barrels is the best thing ever. Look at that. Oh god, there's more. Oh, I think I gotta use my barrel here again in order to take him out. Let me try to make my way through them. No, no, no. Run, buddy. Run. Run. You gotta pay attention. There's one. You also gotta take out this fellow. The problem is this guy has a shield. He's not dying. Didn't I get that upgrade that's taking out their shields? What the heck? Why is he not working? Hold up, let me check, let me check. So if I go into my gun... Yes, we actually have this one. Bullets can penetrate energy shields. But for some reason, it's not working. 
Hmm. So weird. Why isn't it working though? Oh, you know what? It is working, but it takes a lot of bullets to take him out. Look at that. Are you kidding me? Wow. That guy took so many shots. That was insane. All right, let's keep on going. Let's see what we can unlock here. So thankfully, uh, we have some more XP hidden around here somewhere. Hold on, buddy. Let's interact with that. There we go. More XP. Perfect. Uh, let me make my way at the bottom because I do have to make my way to the other side. And I feel like the only way we can do is just through here. What is this? Huh. I got no clue what that is. Maybe that's a shield it dropped? I don't even know. More XP. Perfect. What do we got here? Can I interact with this? Yes, we can. So this one is gonna allow me to go somewhere. Hmm. Oh, I think I gotta put here, yeah, so that we can cross the other side, just like that. There we go. Awesome. That's perfect. Uh, nothing we can track with this, and I think that is. Oh no! 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 <laughs> that was epic. Get out of here, buddy. Come on. All right, and ultimately, we gotta take out this fella, but he's gonna take a few shots because he's got this crazy looking shield. Come on, buddy. You gotta die already. There we go. What I think is that now my bullets, because we do have this upgrade. Uh, hold up. We got this upgrade right over here. Use telekinesis to automatically propel bullets towards your target, which means uh, you don't really have to actually aim straight at him or straight at his head. The bullets are going to go straight into him eventually. Which is really cool. I wonder if I should actually use this instead so I can put a lot of bullets into them. Hmm. Yeah, I don't even know. Let's just try it, I guess. Let's just try this one. This one and this one. Let's just see how this how this goes. All right, we got another control over here, and this one should be taken. Let's see. I don't even know where I gotta take this one though. I'm really confused right now. <clears throat> I do feel like I gotta go there though. Because I see that there's a window that's broken, right? So I gotta find a way to get there somehow. But the question is, how? Is this is just allowing me to go left and right, and that's about it. Hmm. What? Oh, you know what I gotta do? I think I know, I think I know. Hold up. I think I gotta go back here. Interact with this other one as well. Yes, yeah, so we gotta get this one going this way. There we go. That's what we had to do. Interesting. And now we can cross. Perfect. Once again, no easy way out. Hmm. There's a lot of enemies down there, eh? I gotta pay attention. Are these guys gonna spot me? Hopefully not. Jump. Whoa, what the heck? Oh my god, this device that we just got now with the machine gun, it's really powerful. The problem is, 
Uh, we cannot really shoot that much because our chip is going hot. Oh, and look at this. As soon as it's going hot. Apparently, I gotta do it again. I gotta activate all these things in it again or... Actually, no. It's all good. Never mind. Why is it not shooting fast then? I don't get it. Hold up, let's try this again. So let me just uh, remove all of them. Put this one in, this one in, and this one. Alright, we're good now. Let's just try it again and see if it's gonna work. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? This is pretty neat, but it's really difficult to stay away from getting shot by them. I mean, is it even working? I don't even know, to tell the truth. Look at that. Bullets seem to be going everywhere, but not really into my target. <laughs> Here we go, buddy. No, 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 hide. Hold up, hold up, hold up, you gotta run. Run. Don't die, buddy. That was too close. You know what? I don't like this. I really, really don't like this gun. So what I'm going to do here is just replace it again with this, this, and this. This is going to be much better in my opinion. So let's just try it out like that. We can also get ourselves actually another upgrade. Let's do that. What is this? Reduces implant heating when using power. Oh. So what if I use this, this, and this then? Is this going to be good enough now? Wow. It's much better now because um, the implant is not overheating anymore. Yeah, look at that. That's the way to go. Oh, God. <laughs> Love it. Hold up, buddy. We gotta hide. We gotta hide. Man, this gun is crazy. I mean, look at that. It is still overheating, of course, but not as much as it did previously. Or at least not as fast. Yeah, and now we ha actually kind of have time, enough time to take out the enemies. Alright, perfect. We got that going. Let's just keep on going this way, I guess, and see if we can find some secrets. Shut up, buddy. There we go. That was awesome. Alright, hold up. Before I'm gonna go on that path, because I feel like that's gonna be the main path. Let me go here for a second. Yeah, look at that. Another secret right here somewhere. It's gonna be right over here. Alright, that's done. After this, I'm gonna have to put some upgrades into my other abilities, not just the gun. And I see some turrets at the bottom here that Too I'm gonna have to turrets. pay attention for, yeah. Taking the stairs was definitely a bad idea. Yep, definitely not gonna take the stairs, buddy. I wonder if I can actually hack them from over here. I tracked down the expert. He's at the top floor of building three. I'm intercepting a communication. Oh, look at that. And how long will it take for the evaluation? It won't be longer than an hour. I see. I'll also need an update on the search about Keyclub. Well, sadly, Capno's killed him before we could do anything. We'll have to close that file. I expect no more trouble in this case. I can guarantee there won't be any more, sir. Are you sure about that, buddy? He's coming downstairs. Huh. I guess I'm gonna have to probably take him out. So let's see if I can actually make my way to him to take him out somehow. Also, I gotta go and expect him right over here, right? Oh no! I did not want to do that. Jesus! <laughs> I definitely did not want to do that. All right, let me see if I can actually grab this and expect for this fella here. <laughs> Look at that! Don't be gotcha. Foolish. Put that gun away. Kill the expert, hurt the expert. You know what? I'm not gonna kill them. I'm just gonna hurt him. That sadistic bastard. 
the world would probably be a better place without him. But all I was looking for was justice. I wouldn't have shot an unarmed man. Hmm. I actually thought he was going to take him with him and uh, get some information out of him. Uh, because if I knew that he was just going to leave him there and just hurt, I think I would have actually taken him down. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know about you guys, but I think I would have actually taken him down. Ooh. Okay. Accept call. Mr. Kapnos? I trust that your presence here is not the result of reckless moves. Reckless move? You've been trying to kill me like it was nothing. You see, Mr. Kapnos, you think you are the victim here, but none of this is about you. We are all part of a complex system, and both me and you are simply involved in one of its countless procedures. Ser seriously now, buddy? Procedures? My life is just a procedure to you, buddy? Your life, Mr. Kapnos? We are like two cells of the same body. We just have different functions. You see, my own freedom is not greater than yours. But my role requires me to prevent the state from being betrayed. You are not the victim, Mr. Kapnos. You are nothing more than a suspicious transaction I'm investigating. If you keep creating problems, you'll turn from being the evidence to being the crime. Wow. Seriously, buddy, all I see is you having fun playing with my life. Looks like the deadline to peacefully reach the court has just expired, Mr. Kapnos. Unfortunately, I am forced to consider you uncooperative. And to request the intervention of the police department. Oh my god, we're gonna have the police against us now. I'm not going to accept this injustice. I highly suggest you stop resisting. If you want your voice to be heard in our system, the best advice I can give you is to start playing by its rules. Goodbye, Mr. Kapnos. Playing by the system's rules. That was exactly what I was gonna do. Fall and <laughs> final settlement. There are two main creditors involved in the circuit at bankruptcy. If we can find a deal with them, we can stop the whole procedure before the auctioning. But we may need the neural connectome for that. Anyway, I'll explain on the way. Man. Alright, let's get back in the car then and uh, go to our next destination. Again, in that car, waiting for new instructions. A few minutes to get dry and warm, and we already had to find a new landing spot. Oh, look at this. We gotta watch uh, with the camera and try to find the uh, landing spot, eh? That's Bozowski's basement. He's our man for the newer connector, and he owes me a favor. All right, what about these guys? We can't land here. Now that the police department is involved, no oh one must God. suspect that I'm helping you in any way. This is right now we're gonna have police against us. Wait, I think I found a good spot not too far away from here, but you'll need to be careful. Oh, okay, never mind. Whoa, look at that drone. Are you kidding me? I, I think I'm gonna have to actually stay away from these drones. Uh, these are probably... Yeah, these are probably the cops looking after me, and if they are gonna spot me, they're probably gonna try to take me out. Alright guys, well, you know what, I think uh, this is where we're gonna have to end up this episode of Foreclose. And uh, let me tell you guys, so far it's getting really, really interesting. I have to get to the bottom of this and uh, clear my name here and just stop this madness that is happening right now. But I'm really, really loving this so far. And also the gun. The gun is definitely feeling much better than it used to the, um, when we first started using it. Anyway, guys, that being said, thank you all very much for watching another episode of Foreclose. If you all enjoyed this and want to see more like this, as usual, make sure to smash the like button down below. Subscribe if you guys are new here to the channel, and I will see you all in the next one coming up really soon. Bye, everybody.